Skelligs Rope Walk Sunday as well. People, since I moved here to this gated area, I have been attacked by a molester. He tried to get a young girl into his home, I stopped him. No, I was never arrested in my life, never. And because of this molester attacking me, the girl that have arrested me, I have last FCOPD, I have another lung emphysema. They put me in a cell for 22 hours barefoot. My lungs were collapsing. A doctor was called afternoons for me to the cell and he told the girl that I should not be long in that cell. <clears throat> they put me back into the cell again. In the evening, the second doctor was called. He told him I shouldn't be in the cell. They put me back into the cell again barefoot. 22 hours. Then they took me a second time because of this molester. I uh, retaliated against him. They handcuffed me behind my back. They threw me into their wagon face down. My face hit the ground because I was handcuffed behind my back. My glasses broke, my, my nose busted open. I was covered in my own blood. I was rolling around the floor of their police wagon and they were driving quickly just to make it more painful for me. And I'm rolling around the ground. They took me to Grana Boho Garda station. They strip searched me and they put me in the cell again, totally full of my blood. Those are the facts. I'm willing to state that before any court of law. And they're protecting this molester down here now again. And Sheer Charity took him out of a secure unit, St. Michael's, and they brought him back here. And he's molesting and urinating everywhere. And he's molesting with a big sweeping brush handle that Sheer Charity always give him. He's attacking Sheer Charity workers also. But they let it happen because they're getting good money. He's in there, look. Whelan is his name. Whelan. He's a child molester. Would somebody help me here? Would somebody help me before I go to jail? Please.